the sweetest of the sweet, the sparkliest of the sparkles, it's your special guest hosts, Gigi and Molly the Unicorns! Oh, and unicorns! I am, like, so happy to be hosting the Fingerling Show! What's up, fam? I am Gigi, and this is one of my bestest and oldest friends from Sparkle Heights, Molly! Oh, wow, you guys! It is so awesome to meet you. I've heard so much about all of you. Yeah! <laughs> what do we do now? I don't know. I, I think they play a cartoon or something. I, I'm usually in my dressing room. Just, just keep smiling. Just keep smiling! Enjoy the show, folks! The smile broom, enamel sweep, sweep, clean, clean mouth, mouth, open mouth! Oh, oh, oh! It is better to keep your mouth closed and let people think you are a fool than to open it and remove all doubt. Ha-ha! <sighs> it's a toothbrush. Well, I just don't see it. He's escaped! The monster's escaped! No! No! <laughs> <laughs> oh, smashing motion picture. <laughs> hey, fam! I'm here for the sleep. Never mind. I am so freaking out right now, you guys! Sometimes life can give you lemons. Yeah! And when that happens, you need to make lemon-flavored candy. Wait, that doesn't sound right. Well, here is a super sneak peek of our next cartoon all about that very topic. Sour lemon drops? No, lemon pie? That just doesn't make sense. And make sure to come back to check out the whole tale. <laughs> Wow, this is so refreshing. Oh, come on, you guys. We can make the best of this. Ah, oh, what a delicious sleep, friends. Now come, let us sojourn into the outdoors for a beautiful day of fun and games. Pardon my vernacular, but this party is just commencing. Ha, 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 ha. Well, if you can't beat them, join them, I guess. <sighs> Back to bed. Back to bed. Hey, you guys! Uh, this isn't funny! Thank you so much for having me as a guest. Girl, please, you're in the fam now! <laughs> And remember, if you're doing anything, you may as well do it unicorn style! DJ Boris, show him how it's done! Let's do this! <laughs> the making of the greatest Fingerlings movie ever made. Like, ever. The documentary. Filmed over 28 months and cast with every superstar in the Fingerlings world, the film was set for commercial and critical success. Why is it so expensive? But despite concerns from studio head Finn McBigwig, production moved forward, casting their first lead role, that of Fingerlings star, Boris the Monkey. I'm in a movie, I'm in a movie, I'm in a movie. A veteran performer on the Fingerlings show, Boris was eager to spread his artistic wings. I guess, yeah, I was looking to show that I had a serious side. I get typecast a lot as the funny dude, the handsome lead, the love interest, stuff like that. I guess I just wanted the world to know there's a real actor behind all this leading man exterior. I'm in a movie! I'm in a movie! I'm in a movie! This city is mine! 
just like this sky, all mine. I'm their protector, their savior, their... Ah! Cut! Written, produced, and directed by Marge the Sloth, the film was an opportunity for the mammal to tell a deep and personal story. I like when stuff blows up. And... Action! Uh, I forgot my line. Who am I playing again? Cut! In a daring move, the studio agreed to cast the minis, an acting troupe notorious for causing trouble wherever they go. No, you listen to me. We are partners, and partners can't be stopped. We are one. You hear me? One. I love you, man. Now let's stop these bad guys. Well, I just read the part and immediately knew we had to stop doing our two monkey play and immediately commit. Oh, yes, very true. They did spend a lot of money, though, didn't they? Please, please, Marge. Can you please stop spending so much money? This movie is killing me. Yeah. No. But I'm the boss! Oh, man. Capitalizing on her immense popularity on social media, the studio hired mega personality Gigi the Unicorn in hopes of increasing box office success. Um, instead of answering your questions, do you mind if I plug my new cartoon? Well, I guess. Oh, goodness! Um, do we have a clip? Uh, you brought one, so, yeah. Can I tell you a secret? Please. Okay, well. As production moved on, Marge doubled down on her wish to film the most expensive dance number ever made. Mainly because the Glitter Girls had very good lawyers. Defying all expectations, Marge cast robotic action star, Rob Osapien. Come with me if you want to live, before I destroy you! I just really connected with the script. Um, does anyone know what this movie is about? <laughs> so much money! Unicornica, you won't stop me! Cat Raptor, my arch nemesis, you aren't going anywhere! Well, what are you going to do about it? Disclaimer, fingerling toys do not shoot real laser beams. Call it a success or failure. Call it the whim of people with too much money. <laughs> I never agreed to this! But if there is one thing to be said for Marge's greatest and only film ever made, it's that the power of dreams is still alive and well in the world of the fingerlings. That is, until... But that's a story for another time. Welcome one and all to the world where buckets are iced, pancakes are drawn, beans are boozled, and bunnies are fluffy. That's right, it's the wide world of challenges! 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 Welcome everybody to the wide world of challenges. My name is Billy, and this is my BFF and co-anchor, Aiden. <laughs> Ah, oh, love you too, pal. We have a fantastic lineup of Fingerlings challenges for you today. First up, we have Hang 10. Hook them, dangle them, but don't drop them. First one to Hang 10 wins. Next is the Tumbling Tower. Flip the die, then pull the same color block and put it on top. There is no winner, only a first loser. And make sure you don't become it by knocking over the tower. Then it's Puzzle Mania. 
First one to assemble this awesome fingerlings puzzle wins! Yeah, super cute! Finally, it's the jewelry challenge! Make the most amount of wearable pieces of jewelry in the time allotted, and you not only win, but you'll look fabulous! That's right, Aiden! An exciting lineup for an exciting day! And now, let's meet our contestants! They make an impression wherever they go, usually in the ground under their feet. Hailing from beautiful downtown Melody Village, here they are! Bella and Boris Hugs! Aw, look at them! So cute! Now, let's do some challenges! Alright, let's get started with Hang 10! Well, Aiden, you can smell a competition in the air. We should be in for some great matches today. <laughs> you are correct, sir. It'll certainly be a close one with these newcomer competitors. And here we go! Oh, Boris Hug showing his mini a little love, I guess. <laughs> You're right, Aiden. Nothing wrong with that. I love dragons, too. That should be a strong anchor piece for sure. Boris jumping ahead with a strong lead. Yes, they definitely seem like they're not in a hurry. Very cautious play style, sizing each other up and... Oh my! The hugs appear to be... snuggling with their minis instead of hanging them. True, they are called hugs. This is awkward. Next up, we have Tumbling Tower! The mini grounds crew appears to be helping the players set up. That's nice of them. You gotta love the minis. Lots of heart. 14 levels, 42 pieces. One objective, win! That's right, Aiden. Let's get stuck in! What? What's happening? Yes, it, it appears they're trying to write something with the blocks. Oh, you're right. That was pretty sweet. That's, that's, uh, that's real nice right there. I know. Okay, next challenge. Welcome back, everybody. And you know what that music means. It's puzzle time! First one to assemble this awesome puzzle with the animating eyes wins the round! Now, let's put it all together! And here we go! The hugs off to a friendly start? It appears the hugs are being hypnotized by the puzzle face. Ah, uh, here we go again. I... I got nothing, folks. This is a first for me. Sure, jewelry. Good idea. It's the challenge where pretty meets precarious. It's the Jewelry Time Challenge! Boris Hodge taking the initiative and grabbing his first piece. Really great technique here. Might turn into an actual competition. Seems to be examining the piece carefully can really tell this is a player with great instincts. Bella Hugs seems to be complimenting her opponent on his play. Now that's just good sportsmanship right there. Okay, folks, I, I have to be honest. I was pretty doubtful that we could get a serious match in here. Before that, I want to apologize. I, I should have known that two professional competitors like these would always come back to the game. Well, that's kind of you to say, Aiden. Let's get back to this Tournament of Champions. <laughs> I knew it. No, I don't know who won Aiden. I'm not even sure if they knew they were competing, to be honest. Tell us who you think won in the comments below. Because I sure don't. Welcome back, everybody. And are you in for a treat? That's right, Aiden! It's the Fingerlings Pizza 
That's a challenge! For those of you playing at home, you know the rules. Each player brings 10 mystery ingredients for their pizza. Each player spins the wheel, and their opponent puts the corresponding ingredient on the pizza. Once they put on three toppings, they cook it and then swap pizzas so their opponent can enjoy their favorite toppings. <laughs> That's right. And the first player to chew and fully swallow that piece wins. Now, who wants to meet our challengers? First up is Noah the Dragon. He lives his life like he likes his pizza, hot and spicy. And his opponent, hailing from Panda Town, he's cute, he's cuddly, and he hasn't met a piece of bamboo he didn't love. Ladies and gentlemen, Drew the Panda! Our two opponents taking position behind the counter, and here we go. Noah takes the first spin and the wheel lands on seven. Noah, liking it spicy, pulls out. Oh! Pulls out some hot sauce! That's some dragon action for you right there, folks. Strong first move. Drew takes his spin and we land on a three. Drew bringing some respectable panda style bamboo shoots to the table. A gentleman's play. Ooh! Ooh! Mmm, boy, indeed. Noah, back at it. Let's see what this dragon can do. Oh, it's a one. Looks like it's a healthy sprinkling of hot cinnamon candy. Looks like there's always a little bit of sweet with the heat for Noah the dragon. Drew, back at it. Lands on an eight. Donuts! We have donuts! A solid panda move! I guess a little donut wouldn't hurt anyone. Whoa! Pandas certainly like their donuts, don't they? Noah's final spin, and we'll see where it lands. And it's a nine! Oh, let's see what our Blaze Mountain friend finishes with. Hot peppers! Noah brought the hot peppers! Oh! Oh! If I were Drew, I'd be getting pretty nervous right about now. Dragons like Noah do not mess around with their spicy food. Drew with his last spin, going to have to come up with a miracle here, and he comes up with a five. Let's see what the panda who's the manda has up his adorable furry sleeve. Toothpaste! Drew brought toothpaste! Oh! Oh! Ooh! He brought the toothpaste! If I were Noah right now, I'd be hoping that the panda has a problem with spicy food. Time for the cook-off! Sometimes competition isn't pretty, Aiden. And now, the moment of truth. Who will eat the first bite the fastest? Grab a banana cone? Yeah, I could go for a banana cone. So, there you have it, folks. The Fingerlings Pizza Challenge. <laughs> uh, no, Aiden, I hardly think you could eat either of those pizzas. <laughs> oh, you have a sensitive stomach and you know it. <laughs> this has been the Wide World of Challenges. Aiden, no! You are watching the Fingerling Show! Now here they are, the monkeys with the most, the hostess and the host, Bella and Boris! Thanks, everyone! Gigi, what's going on? Uh, nothing. Just wanted to teeter-totter with someone. Aw, no one wants to teeter with ya. Yup. And totter, too. I guess I'm just... <laughs> Sorry, I was... late. Okay, dude, seriously, we need to figure out who the new fingerling is. This is getting ridiculous. No offense.
to be your best friend. Oh, that's very nice of you. But what do you... I want to be your best friend. Please? Oh, dudes. We should say something? Never mind. Why won't you love me? I guess what I really want to say is that I am sorry. Okay. Sorry that I did not destroy us. So Dudes, we really need a coordinator. Stay tuned for more Who Wants to Be a Fingerling? Hey, everyone! Here's a sneak peek of a new fingerling's tail! And make sure to come back for the whole shebang! Enjoy the clip! I'm okay. And what are you doing today? Bouncing. And why is that? Oh, you're trying to set the world record for the most jumps in a single day? Nope! I'm gonna break it! Thanks for watching, everyone! Anything to add, Marge? Hey, every... Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Oopsie! DJ Boris, play us out of here! Shh, Polly, spoiler alert, let's not ruin the surprise. See you next time.